GTA 5, we're doing the story missions. Dead Man Walking, Part 1, Double A Gamer for Life. Okay, so in order for me to get gold, it took uh, two times through this mission to do it. And uh, getting the headshots, uh, accuracy, and uh, the focus kills in. It's pretty much its own video, and it's kind of lengthy as well. This video is about 25 minutes. And normally when I uh, do one, I'll try to put the two videos together that makes one. But let's get through this cutscene. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that. Then I'll kind of get into what's going to happen. seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if no when, he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. <sighs> We're in it. Together. So, if... Your problems are my problems. Then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. Well, then we better go about saving it together, because you and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy, Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently, he has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? Oh. Oh. That's gonna leave a nice head on the top of your head. Or the back side of your head. You. I don't know, it was like, oh, maybe you could have used a, fit, <coughs> a taser on him or something. Instead of putting a big knot on the back of his head. But anyway, you get knocked out, you're going to wake up in the morgue. And we're well, going to have to go find this guy that they want us to find, but he won't be here. Let's take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. We're probably about to find one in his gut, still in its wrapper. Right next to the bottle of scotch and pack of redwoods. See the broken capillaries around the nose? Ah! Oh, Jesus! Ah! Back from the dead, ah! motherfucker! Ah! 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 Come out! Hands in the air! Out! Now! Out of there! Okay, so like I was mentioning, this video is quite lengthy. Um, trying to get the headshots in and get some focus kills in. So in between uh, when your special ability runs out, you have to uh, build up your ability. But getting uh, four kills shouldn't be a problem with the focus. I found the toe tag. Ferdinand Karamov. It's on some big black lead. Okay, now the Definitely one thing I've learned, and this was before okay. I was doing this mission, the have the lower is uh, reusing the checkpoint. So I got a guy who can cut uh, the let's say you find help, an area where you can get uh, four headshots in, and, and then you can get yourself killed and just keep replaying the checkpoint until you get your 14 headshots in and then continue hey, on. Put your hands on your head. Okay, when you're trying to do your uh, your time for the mission and then get out of there with minimal damage uh, you want to you know attack the mission a little differently
Okay, so you want to get through the mission very quick, but you don't want to take any damage. So, uh, you know, headshots are out of the question. If you can get some in, great. If not, don't worry about it because you'll have already got your accuracy in, your headshots, and your focus kill. So uh, the thing will, the next time through will be just to get through it quickly. This beginning guy, he's like most of the time would come up in here. That's why I'm kind of hanging back. But now he's like in the back room and I need to move up in order for him to get out. He's back there. I could live without the flashlight on the gun. Uh, it's one thing of the in the game, which I just don't find the the flashlight useful. It's just uh, they put it in the game, and it's just not something. I mean, you can see just fine without the flashlight. And there's people that argue that the flashlight stun people. I don't know. You know, the light gets in their eyes, and it, I don't know, it just doesn't seem to be effective. All right, so I want to try to use that corner. Carry on with your business. Okay, definitely use Michael's special ability sparingly. It's definitely uh, useful in this mission. So click in it, click out of it. Okay, so you're going to have several guys to be dealing with here. I like to run up a little bit to get them to come to me, then get back to this corner. Reloading. There's no way out. This is fucked. You're dead. Okay, so we're chipping away at the headshots. It would have been nice to get through this without taking uh, minimal damage, but it does happen, and uh, it becomes a lot easier in the uh, second time through, which will be in the next video. As you can see, the special ability does uh, come in helpful. I hate this stupid flashlight. And uh, I do believe there's an option to turn it off, but at the time, I didn't really know about it. I don't know what's going on here, but I want to fuck out. It's over. And I'm not 100% sure you can, but I think you can turn it off. But nevertheless, uh, I get through it using it. Kind of hate it when those guys get back in that examinatory room there. You can't really get a good beat on them. Here he comes. Trust me, I'm not interested in the truth. Okay, definitely make sure to run over their bodies. Uh, at some point, one of them has a shotgun and the other has an SMG. I've got your number. Fuck it, dick. Ah, you're dead. 
Here comes one around the corner. Right in the forehead. Is this the way out? Here I go. Your mother should have followed you. Okay, the later part of the video when we get out of here. Uh, you're going to have three stars, and I wind up cutting some of that out, or most of it, because uh, it actually took me quite a while to lose the Wanda level, and uh, I already had the mission time well past, so it wasn't really an issue. So with the next video, when we complete the mission in the time frame, I'm going to leave how I lose the Wanda level, and uh, so obviously if you're dealing with a time frame... You know, getting through your WANA level quickly is going to be beneficial to you to make your, your time, so. You motherfucker! Asshole! Hey, I already died once today! These guys pop in and out of cover so fast. You motherfucker. Just let me go. Okay, be careful up here. There's always like somebody behind this desk that likes the camp there. You're mine. And then we're going to have uh, one or two guys coming through the doors here as well. It's all a big misunderstanding. Okay, so pretty much got all headshots, most of them anyway. But Michael's special abilities ran out now. Okay, there are so, <coughs> excuse me, there are several health packs along the way as well. Okay, when you get up here, you got this guy in the elevator, and he's got an SMG. Okay, right there on the wall is a health pack. Okay, when you get up here, there'll be a guy that comes out. No one comes in or out. You need to take him out. I don't know what's going on here, but I want to fuck out. Okay, I don't know, that kind of looked like a headshot. Okay, we're going to have another dude coming around the corner. Stay right there. This is fucked. That's what I was saying. Um, you know, if you're taking the time to get your headshots in, you're probably going to take damage and run around for those health packs. So don't sweat it because we're going to come back and get our, <clears throat> our time and our minimal damage in at the same time. Okay, this guy kind of likes to hang on that wall there. He likes to pop in and out of cover. But what's going to happen is uh, once you get inside this door, it's going to trigger a couple dudes from underneath to come up. So you got to be cautious about that. Carry on with your business. 
All right, that looked like a headshot. Okay, I'm not seeing the red dots yet. This is for the greater good. Okay, that will get these guys to come from up underneath. So I'm gonna run down and meet them head on. Okay, I was uh, mistaken. I guess they're chasing me down the stairs. This the way out? Again, don't uh, forget about the health pack. So backtrack and get them. Okay, so we got one on that counter, and if you wind up going up there and getting shot up more, there's another pack right here on the wall by the stairs. Which, uh, our time is already uh, well past making it through the mission, and... I'm not sure uh, we're going for headshots and the focus kills, so I don't think any of those would be really affected if you were killed and then had to reload a checkpoint. Okay. I was <coughs> pretty sure that two dudes came up behind me, and there, the, there one of them was. Here comes the next one. Another headshot in. And again, I took some damage. And I also believe that there's a health pack up here as well. Okay, right up here is our weapons and armor. Thought maybe I could drink some sodas and get my health up, but that's not the case. Okay, when you pick up that armor, uh, your weapons are right there. If I was to pull up my uh, wheel, uh, my slot should all be full. Okay, but it looks like uh, we got all the enemies down, so probably coming back for this health pack was not necessary. But again, uh, the mission time was, you know, well past, so better safe than sorry. So when you jump out here, uh, there'll be a few cops, uh, probably worth your while to shoot one or two of them. So as you're jacking the car, you don't uh, take too much damage. So that's why it's a good idea to fill your health up and to have your armor filled up. I don't believe I take the time to shoot these guys. I just get in here and take off. Okay, so like I mentioned, I cut most of this chase out. It took me forever to lose the heat. And the next video will show you how I get through. i show you the whole thing of me losing the heat and all that. And I get the mission done under time. So just check out the next video as far as getting our accuracy. Or, well, we get accuracy on both uh, times through. 
But uh, the next video is sure basically about tail. getting through under time Man, and uh, taking minimal Look damage. So once you lose the heat, uh, you call Franklin, you tell him to meet you, you call Dave. Dave, and then go the meet Franklin for the ending the cinematic. And then we're going to come back with the I'm next sorry. video on how to They're get our other nice goal requirements. That's a consolation. What's going on? There's a big target out there. Something in the shadows. The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the Bureau or the agency, is going to get a big bump in funding. Like I care about your funding. I'm out, Dave. You're not. I need you to meet my boss. We'll be downtown in the plaza between the FIB and the IAA buildings. The IAA building? You fucking kidding me after the spat I just had with those agency men? Relax. They won't be looking there. They never expect an inside job. Franklin, what's going on? You gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? Look, you remember I told you I know people? Feds who looked after me when I retired? You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus Christ, Franklin. I got so many stories, I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. One score with you, I made more money than I ever did hustling. Oh, yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief, but you know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the Bureau, man? This clown, I mean, he's an okay guy, fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his, and everything was cool. The problem started when recently... I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man, yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Uh, man, I, I think so, shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's, I don't, hell walking on Earth. That's what he is. Well, let's bury this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, good luck with that. Shit. I mean, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look, I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. Okay, I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin, you'll swear I am an angel. So what's the mood in, man? I don't know. Fuck. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, until I can find a way out of this shit. All right, man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. It's a death sentence, Franklin. Man, I, I, I ain't trying to hear all that shit, man. If the Bureau ain't gonna take you to court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy, run me up a tree. Fuck that. Hey, you're a good kid, Franklin. This means a lot to me. Like I told you, I'm a terrific thief. I'll find something for you, big. Now come on, you better take off. All right, man, I'm with you. I'm with you. Okay, so it took me a little bit, but there's our three that we got in. We got 11 focus kills. We got over 14 headshots. I don't know exactly the number, and we got accuracy in. Uh, if you died, you'd still get your headshots and your focus kills in. All right, we're going to come back with the next video and get our unmarked and our time in. And uh, we will get accuracy as well. If you like the videos, you can always support us by checking out the ads.